Hey, buggies, how are you? Or I should be saying, how are they, as the usual line goes, but I'm hoping it's just okie dokie. Because I just roll with, you know, whatever I say and try and make it seem like I meant to do it. So, initially, this was going to be a test recording, but I found a funny, uh, a couple of funny things that kind of just caught my eye and made me go, what? What? <laughs> Why? Or like, oh, that's cool. So, this is me picking up on the suggestion I got from a few people on the previous update video or vlog, whatever you want to call it. And I'm going to just, you know, do stuff that's just chill in Minecraft and share some stories and experiences if I can think of them or remember them. Because I might think of something and then it's like that by the time I actually try to remember, it's like, I forgot. So hopefully that won't be the case, but anyways, I'm just going to probably make commentary too, you know. So what I actually was going to show you initially was a cute little family of foxes right over there. And you might be wondering, why do I have this blue dot here? Oh, geez, it's been a while. Oh, no, that's not what I want to do. Is it a five? No. Oh, uh, well, not quite. Well, at least now you can obviously guess who I am in this avatar. The Doctor from Doctor Who's an Assistant. Or more particularly, Pose the Pockets Gaming in Minecraft. Or what I would probably call, since the time, Pocketcraft. Because, well, you gotta make some puns off of pockets somewhere. You know, it's all a matter of pocket change. <laughs> yeah, I do those things. Don't worry, you're, you're gonna be ready to see plenty of puns. And what I initially was wanting to do was get back in streaming, but I didn't find myself to... Whoops. I didn't find myself... Uh... Oh my god, they're so cute. No, he sees me. I don't know what to do with these foxes. I haven't played since before the B update, so I don't know. But hey, that leads me to my next point, or my block in this case. <laughs> because I just made a new world and you know, you know these little classic things that just float everywhere. Yeah, this was here before. I even came here, so this wasn't made by me on purpose. This was just a perfect accident right by my spawn area. And I have this nice view of another biome. Looks a little swampy. So I just kind of thought by doing Let's Plays, I won't really feel so much, you know, I don't want to say under pressure. What's that freaking octopus doing over there? I won't feel like I'm so much under pressure as far as what I'm doing, because I was just really used to, you know, trying to play up the hype player that I thought I should be, because I wasn't really too sure of my own identity, so I thought, well, if I come up with a fun identity that people like, people go for it, and a little fake, but at the same time, it was me trying to go with the idea of fake it till you make it, because I'm fucking anxious as hell. I had so much anxiety just, you know, doing a lot of stream stuff, it was just... I would try and maintain myself, and I don't know. I just didn't really think I held myself at the best I could have been. Oh my god, that was loud. Oh yeah, I have to start all these little things over again. Because, you know, I just wanted to kind of start it fresh, keep it natural. And, well, the reason I did mention streaming was also because... I was honestly debating, you know, keeping the old outfit from when I was doing streaming because, well, I like showing my hairstyle sometimes. But, you know, if you have an outfit that's recognizable, you're recognizable. I mean, yeah, I have big freaking round lens glasses, but, you know, so, so, so does every other nerd in the universe. As any nerd will tell you, round lenses give the most perfect circumference of vision based on the fact that the eyeball is round and not a stupid rectangle like a widescreen TV or theater. I mean, I'm just, you know, stating facts. Like most nerds slash geeks do. And I am trying to figure out some 
color balance with my video and whatnot, but I have a decent sized monitor that's like, well, I think it's 30 inches, 32 inches, because I wanted something that was great for first person shooters and other games and just, you know, give me an ability to have a nice fine detail. What you're seeing right down there, I converted through OBS into 720p. Still good, but I mean, I guess what I'm seeing, but if I tried to give you guys my uh, 1440p or 1080, no, it is actually 1440, holy shit. 1440p, hello, I know, shush. Don't bother me so much. Move on, move on. Yes, I did make that bad pun, shut up. I'm talking about virtual cow, what's my problem? I have no idea. Well, this cow freaking following me. Well, you guys knew I lost my mind a long time ago, so there is that, and I play crazy characters, so it's a match. But, anyways, I just kind of thought, I looked, oh, mossy. Does that mean there's a dungeon? But not a Minecraft dungeon? I just kind of thought, well, if I'm going to do videos again, I may as well kind of have the old setup, or get up, too. <laughs> the get up and the setup. I'm sorry, I'm just... A little nervous also doing this again. I had to actually calm myself down at first. Not like an anxiety attack type of thing, but it was like, Oh, stage fright. Holy shit. Here we go again. I am not used to doing this like I used to. It is supposed to be fun, yes. But I don't want to make it seem like it isn't what it is. What the hell am I going? I need to knock down... Not that one. I need to knock down a tree. I'll knock it down with this mushroom. Mario's getting wood, bitches. Yeah, I might make some crude humor, but it's not going to sound the same as it might have when I was super hyper about it. It's just, if I do get hyper, there'll be specific and good reason for me to be over the top. But until then, you know, I'm just a cheesy dork, as most people... Oh my god, how far can I reach? As a cheesy dork, as most people know me. Hey... I got wood. Giggity. Yeah, don't worry, I have old jokes in here too. I'll keep you aware of the old and the new. Because every catchphrase is a piece of history. And also show... Oh! What the hell? Did I get attacked by a thorn? Quotes show your age. Unless you're doing history. Even then, you're showing your age because you're spending time looking at... Well, I guess it is news of the world over time. I'm going to need more wood anyways. But I'm thinking just as far as Twitch goes... Eh... I think I'll just need specific reasons to just do it because I I don't know if I'm really into that streaming thing like I was because I, yeah it's great because when I can have an experience shared with people live but it takes more like I told you guys those of you who have been watching past videos I told you how long it takes to do editing and I'm glad to, but if I'm going to do multiple streams at a time, which are like two or three hours, that's more footage than what I can work with, especially if I need to, you know, do something else to it. But this, at least when I had like nice little funny parts to it, because this is actually meant to be shorter. Don't mind the gas. You know, I have no idea what I'm actually going to do in editing until I do it. So whatever happens, it'll probably be a little chaotic because I don't know. Got to do it for the memes or whatever comes from it. Fit in my day, we... Oh, fuck. I can't do freaking, like, impressions at all. God damn, I gotta get out of here. What? Okay, I'll get a boat. But I need to get a cave. This is not a cave. You know... It's times like these, I remember why I always got lost in uh, Pocket Craft. Oh, what the... What? It... I just barely saw the freaking sundown. Oh my god, man. 
Oh, okay, this isn't a giant-ass dungeon. It's just frickin' mossy cobblestone. Oh, fuck. Yeah, I'm not doing any bleeps. This is gonna be too much bleeping. I swear like a sailor, but... I wonder if that's because I'm from Irish descent that I'm just naturally eloquent in my swearing. I'll provide different levels of emphasis on different swearing, like damn shit and fuck. I mean, there's different reasons to say different... Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Oh, God. Oh, fuck. Oh, God. Fuck. Damn ass. Ass. Motherfucker. Fucking God. Damn. Motherfucker. Yes, I'm eloquent. Shut up. Fuck. Oh, God. Fucking shitting. God damn it. I'm using only three fucking swears, but I'm using it as cleverly as I can. What the fuck are those? Ah, shit, I forgot about the spider. Oh, fucking god damn it. Of course there's a creeper. Uh, I'm gonna try and find a cave instead of trying to make a freaking mud hut because this isn't gonna work. I might need to make a mud hut. With the power of my fists. The best kind of handiwork that there is. That's a... F that counts as fall damage? That is fucking an ass bullshit. Back in my day, that didn't count. Oh, I'm fine. I got a chicken, a cow, and at least two creepers. Spider. Skeleton. Ooh, boy. Yeah. Shut up, I don't have a farm yet. But I will take your egg. Got my eye on that spider. Oh, boy. Cake. Alright. Time to make a premature basement. I can make a roof. Oh god damn, this is gonna kill me. Fucking nope. God damn it. There we go. I fucking forgot all the controls. That ain't it. Oh yeah. Duh. I need to make it into planks of sorts. Then do this. Then do that. Then I look at my spell book. I'm gonna, not going to summon any zombies or nothing. Don't worry about me. I'm going to be fine. I'm not a necromancer except in MMOs, but that's totally different. I tell you this. I am not going to cause any trouble further than what I can expect. But I can't make any guarantees. Damn it. Wrong one. If for random sticks. Work, damn it. God damn, it looks so white in this webcam. I'm not saying that just because of my color, but I'm just saying my skin's fucking reflective at this point. Can't see shit down here. Give me a fucking cabin. Need more stairs than this. You know... Might not actually be a good thing to, you know, look for an actual cavern. Because that might be an issue. A huge issue. Nobody lacks issues. Oh, God damn, I keep pressing I for inventory. Fuck, I need to change the damn controls and I'll get used to these old controls and then I'll have to get used to new controls again. That's going to be a reversal. Drives me nuts. And forgot all my recipes. And I don't have any coal. <laughs> of course I don't have coal. 
I need light. <laughs> With what coal? Unless they kept changing the recipes. Oh my god, man. Oh, damn it. It's in my eye by rubbing my eye. Whoa. I can't see shit, man. I don't know what I'm mining, but I'm digging. Let's see what I pick or don't pick. With any luck, I'll find some lava. Or. Yeah. Where's the magma? Oh, it's magma. Uh, just remembered. But I could be wrong. I may be right, but I may be crazy. But it might, just, but it might be just a lunatic that you're looking for. I'll get these quotes right eventually after I actually clear my eye. God damn. Oh, my god. Ugh, my god. This is very problematic. I cannot see anything. I cannot find no coal. Where, oh, where is this stupid? Freaking, oh, don't tell me there's someone there. I will lose my sheet. My sheet. My sheet of homework. Oh, well, you know, that's just nice. A zombie in my left ear. Uh, nothing can go wrong. Everything's fine. Oh. Now I get more recipes for the cobble of stoning. Well, that's just fantastic. So, anyways, I'm trying to think of some other story stuff I can kind of talk to you guys about. But, I don't know, I don't want to repeat myself too much. It's just that overall, when it came to... Oh, fuck me. When it came to a lot of... Um, dealing with things, I wasn't always in the best state of mind, and I would never felt like I was able to be calm enough to even know who I was. That doesn't make sense entirely, but... The simplest way I can probably think about telling you is that I went through a lot of stressful time, you know, levels of trauma and to the point of dissociation for different reasons and, well, hereditary imbalance from mental illness. So, those of you who are new, I have... Actually, actually I should probably tell you guys the full list since I actually didn't tell you about the other two. You already know that I'm bipolar 1. I have a other specified dissociative disorder. It's OSDD. It's not DID, which is actually the one where it includes like all dissociative symptoms. And I also have OCD for a more of the invasive thoughts. And yes, OCD has invasive thoughts that might be a bit bad. And of course, PTSD, which kind of connects things a little bit here and there, but... I'm not going to tell you the entire story of that. It's just when you put that cocktail together, it makes things a lot harder to actually process things and perceive things. And eventually, my perception didn't exactly do too well. But in this year, I was actually able to get my head straight with the right medication that actually got the chemicals to finally balance out and I can actually feel like I did almost... 10 years ago. Well, it's not actually me being have gone missing. It's more that I haven't I haven't felt like myself in a long time. But it's an updated version. Like the software in the version of Minecraft. And speaking of which, those of you who are currently um, playing Minecraft on PC with the Java edition, if you haven't seen the news, Microsoft will be looking to convert the, well, I should say Mojang accounts or Minecraft accounts, whichever, since, you know, combined under Mojang eventually. They're going to try and merge Mojang into the Minecraft account, or, sorry, Microsoft accounts. So, 
just a heads up, but I don't know what that'll mean for changes like mods and skins. You know, one of the huge, ironic bedrocks of this game community. I'm a little nervous because, well, I don't want to lose the ability to have my skin and God forbid we can see any more microtransactions to make your own customization. Or have some kind of approval process because who knows how long you can wait, even for something that's as simple as, well, just my doctor avatar. So, again, this is... This is the avatar that Dream of Serenity made for me when we were doing the Pocketcraft gaming. Ugh. That always gives me chills. Ugh. For a game that's meant to be semi-innocent, it's got... Notch made a, did a good job with the initial idea of doing those spooky noises. Ooh. Chills. I'm not sure if I'm relaxed or spooked. We just had Halloween, for God's sake. Give me some god dang... You know, just... Just in case I forget. Gotta make sure I don't forget. You coming with me. Let's beat that cow. <laughs> because we need me. Oh my god! Why? Why me? This is not allowed. I did not ask to be freaking stalked by an Enderman out of nowhere. That sounds nice, doesn't it? That was fair. Oh, look at me. I'm just trying to survive the night, and I come out to see a cow, and suddenly there's a motherfucking Enderman charging straight at my fucking face. What a nice day to... Nice, what a nice way to start the day. Yes, I totally wanted to die by an Enderman, but hey, at least my hunger's restored. Okay, which way did I go? I think I went over this way. I thought Enderman were supposed to, or Endermen were supposed to be, you know, distant and not look, but. I wasn't even looking at him at first. It was just me underground. I was looking at a block and then suddenly, oh my God. And that was no bueno. That was muy mal, muy, muy mal. Need a little bit of extra um, muy on that mall. So, and what the fucking hell was that bullshit? Yeah, it's a nice day outside. I got myself going. I got myself started. I got my stuff and, you know, no defenses. And, well, apparently I got a nice welcome to the neighborhood. Yeah. Well, so much for being a semi-innocent game. I don't have any bones. Great. I have all of this opportunity and no way to seize it. Carpe diem what? Carpe diem carpe died. Is that... That is a floating island. Wait. No, 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 no. An island. You know, I forgot how crazy these seeds are. Because a fucking island grew off of a fucking side of leaves on a tree. You seen this shit? Do you see that? And then I hear a bat. Why? Why do these things happen? 
Why do I go through so much chaos in these things? Anytime I try and, you know, do something creative, apparently fate likes to have a sense of humor. And now I have no idea what exact path I went because I thought I went somewhere safe, somewhere that was a little bit open. Sweet berries. Sweet berries. I have no idea what they do yet, but I'll use them eventually. Oh, hey, there's some lava. How useful. I'll, you know, make some obsidian later. Yeah, I'm sure I am now lost now. And I'm being redundant in the way of... I swear to God, this game's trying to kill me in more ways than one. And I just got started. This is freaking normal mode for Pete's sake. Oh, a horde of piggies. If only I had a sword. A sword. Yeah, I can't take that one down. Move, pigs. I'll use these berries to knock down this tree. Feel the power of sweetness. Sweetness is strong. Sweetness is good. Sweetness is bueno. And if you are aware of what I just said, which is very simple, I said good twice. Because, see. Alright. Got the wood. Time to do a thing. What am I going to do? Let's see. Well, obviously that. Then I'll do this and this and that. Put that over there. Take this right here. Put that down there. Got my thing. Got the thing over there. Over here. No, over here. Nope, not there. Over here. Okay, that's right there. That is brought over here. I'll put it right there. I'll do it right there. I'll do it right there. Right over there. Bring it up. Going down. Put it down there. And look at it. Go up here. Down. Up. Down. Um, I think we're good for the moment. Until the freaking Enderman freaking charges me again. I hear a spider. If my mouse movements are too fast, it's because I've gotten used to just, you know, playing too much TF2. Because I just wanted to get, you know, better at my freaking mouse aim. Mouse aim is a pain in the ass when you don't land your shots. Just need a lot of tracking practice. Fine, let's go with the spruce. The zebra of the tree families. What the? You, you know, yeah, you, you better. Oh, dang, it's getting dark again. How much want to bet I'm going to die by an Enderman again? Well, I think you might have to hold your bet. Is that a Jacob's Ladder? What is this, Animal Crossing? I'm getting this. Lily of the Valley. How interesting. Oh, shit. There goes the sun. Do -do -do -do. So, for now, I will try and stick to a thing of doing this in 30-minute segments because I kind of ran out of what to say because I just kind of got started getting into the game and trying to survive. But I'll see what I can come up with next time. And... You know, I'm kind of chill right now, but I'm also trying to wait on things until things improve with this country and my job situation. I have a potentially new job as long as my background check checks okay because I had to be a little selective in what I was saying due to my mental health causing me to lose jobs more than once. And I didn't feel good about sharing that. And I dealt with some employers that were like saying, hey... 
uh, you have a, quite a bit of experience, and, well, what happened? Why did you jump to so many places? Well, my mental health made me get so much anxiety, I had to run away in some ways. And eventually, I had a solid job at my last job, because I actually was able to get enough time to get my head straight. And then COVID caused the company to close down, close down and now I've just been waiting and losing my mind for over six months. And so, this hopefully new job that I really hope is solid. But, if you want to learn more, go to my Tumblr. And feel free to ask me something. Um, I need to still find like a good security thing for my Discord. So, next video, if not this video, please check the description. I'll see what I can do for my server as far as security goes. Because I don't want to, you know, get bots or some weird hacking thing. Or, you know, bad bullshit. But, go to my Tumblr, Jester, J-E-S-T-R-E, dot Tumblr.com. And I also have my Patreon, you know, if you want to do the support thing. It's up to you. I'm not make you go to do it on purpose because I'm trying to do a job for an income. And the only other time I really do anything for creative income is helping out different productions that I'm a part of. Because I don't know how I really feel about making money off of myself. I don't want to make myself a product, you know what I mean? I don't feel like I myself am a production, even though I make productions. I don't know, it's a weird humility thing and I think a bit of a self-esteem thing. But, yeah, that's about it. So, I shall see you guys, well, next time. And if you want to suggest a game that you want me to let's play in 30-minute segments, up to an hour, depending, please make a suggestion in the comments. And, you know, in case the stupid subscription bell isn't working, keep slapping it a few times. I don't even know when it works because... I still get notifications half a day later for a video that came out half a day earlier. So, regardless, just stay tuned. Um, I'll try and use the stories more. We'll see. But, Tumblr is going to be your best bet. Maybe Twitter, if you're a Twitter person. Eh, I'm a little cautious on Twitter because I'm in America, and when you look at American Twitter, you might want to go... Repeatedly. I'm trying to find good places that can actually feel calm and do stuff like this, you know? So, yes, have a good morning, a good afternoon, a good evening, and good night. I shall see you next time. Love you lots, and be sure... Eh, I can't reach like this. Where's the heart? Where's the heart and soul? Ow. Damn it. I, I'm not used to doing this with my webcam. Frick. Eh, let's try this. God. Damn it. Uh, close enough. It's a foot away, but I'll just collect close enough on this tiny little screen. Alright. Love you. See you next time.